service open in forms at the moment. I'll just one second, is that okay? Feel free to have a quick browse around the shop. Cool means I'll be with you very shortly. for fresh start world is as easy as completing the tutorial island with a new account and selecting fresh start worlds when you leave the island rather then after six months your progress in fresh start worlds will automatically transfer over to the main game that includes your items quest points skill levels and your soul i mean no, don't worry about that so when can i jump back into that game you loved so much when you were younger or begin a fresh start now i hear you ask well fresh start worlds are open now and you can play for free or if you want to unlock even more adventures you can with membership just click that link in the description and sign up for fresh world would like to thank old school runescape for sending us this breaking news and also given me one heck of a good time in my younger years too okay we we done here no i've got a date It's really great to see you again. Welcome back to the game shop. It seems like forever ago when you were in here last time and I was attending you and helping you with all of your gaming needs. How are you? That's so great to see. And here. So what can I do for you today? Anything. This game store it's like your second home, or at least we try to make it like that for you. So, if there's anything you need, it doesn't have to be a purchase of games or anything like that. You can just come in, talk about games if you wish, or talk about tech, consoles, things like that, anything revolving around games then. I'd love to help you and make sure that you leave the store today exceptionally happy with whatever you came in for today. You're looking to buy some games, well, you've come to the right place. <laughs> Any particular games that you're interested in? And naturally, Star Wars, of course, naturally, it's that's very natural. Um, one second then, this is just going off. Uh, I know one of the things and the beauties of this store being open late at night is that I keep it open so customers like you can come in and enjoy and I see it as a little chance to relax and special gamers like yourself could come in here and switch off for whatever is going on for you at the moment so the store's open a little bit later for the more chilled but serious gamers amongst us and you certainly look like one of those so the store's open a little bit later but uh, tonight, everyone seems to be online for some reason. And I've got so many forums open at the moment. So as long as you don't mind the occasional typing, and you find that nice and relaxing. I mean, it's gaming keyboard, so who wouldn't at the end of the day? But as long as you find that nice and relaxing, then you can have a great night. I've got a lot of gamer 
customers online at the moment in this area who do a lot of online shopping and the chap have you met him before he works in daytime that was the last time you came in here well, lucky you well, i hope you are greeted nicely and treated uh it's how i'd like to treat people you weren't no well that's just a little bit unfortunate but that's why the late hours are open for you to come in and relax and you know get what you need to to me you look like an amazing gamer one who's very versed in all things games all the consoles and everything so you can chill here and have a good time but i've got all these customers from daytime and they're ordering like crazy at the moment for some reason i think farquad has been on the chat rooms again and listing everything that people need to buy sorted with some games right so you said Star Wars games we of course have Star Wars games across every platform PC Xbox PlayStation we have it on Game Boys you know Nintendo anything that you want a Star Wars game on I'm pretty sure we've got it here at this game store so are there particular platforms which you want to play these games on PC, that's a fine choice. You could tell a lot about a game by the console that they play with and the platform. And PC is, well, I, in my opinion, one of the top, top platforms for Star Wars games. So, or was so that tells me that perhaps you were looking for some more sort of retro, older Star Wars games, a traditional Star Wars game. I would be right in thinking so. That's good. And is there any other consoles? A little bit older. A PlayStation 2. Any more? Right. No, that's that's a great choice. And I'm quietly confident that in store I've got a lot of games in here which I think that you might be interested in here. So I'll just have a quick look here. We'll see what we've got in stock lurking in the storeroom here yeah, and we can get you sorted with all the star wars games that you need does that sound good perfect well you just relax just enjoy yourself and we'll get you all fitted out with everything you need in this game store as one of the things we like to do is create a good rapport with all of our customers and i took a shining to you last time and to me you're just the epiphany of uh, a professional gamer, someone who knows a lot about games. So I want to make sure that this is a place that you always come to, feel happy when you're here and well looked after. That is the key for any store, is making sure everyone, but mainly you, is happy, having a great time and relaxed, most important. Okay, so on one of the older computers here, so I'm just going through what we've got here. So I'm on PlayStation at the moment, on PlayStation 2. Ah, so we do have Star Wars games in stock on PlayStation 2. And what we have here, we have... Okay, you ready? <laughs> we have Jedi Starfighter. On PlayStation 2, a brilliant game. And then we have Revenge of the Sith on PlayStation 2, the video game. That's an amazing game. We also have Risa Revenge, an amazing game. Okay. And that's 
let's work fine here at the moment. And what's this one here? I think this is where we have all of our PlayStation games on here. Let me just check this for you. Oh, PC games, sorry. Okay. Right, so we have a great collection here as well. I think you're really going to be interested in. So we have Galactic Battlegrounds. Battle for Naboo. Jedi Outcast. Jedi Academy. No, Jedi Outcast. Not the Academy one. And Battlefront. The original. And I think that's about it there. Yeah, that's it. And that's quite a collection of games so if there are any there that you're interested in and you're interested in all of them why would i expect anything less from you well you just strike me as someone who has a keen eye for great amazing games and i'm pretty sure you're gonna have a lot of fun with these games so how about that you get yourself a little bit comfortable if there's anything you need let me know just update these forms one second. feeling comfortable I'll go and get all of those games for you I'll bring them all out you can have a good look at them all we could talk about them open them up you know if you it's a game that you're interested in then I'd love for you to get it and take it home and enjoy with it I can help you with all questions and anything that you need to ask please don't hold it back ask me ask me anything I'll be more than happy to answer it for you and get you fully set up it sounds to me that you're looking for a big nostalgic bump and you want a game or games that's going to offer you something perfect escapism and take you back to Nero when it was literally the gold age for Star Wars games is that right? I knew it you're a person, as shall I say, you're a gamer of great taste. I always knew that about you. Always. Okay, so it won't take me a moment just to go and get those games here from the store. So please just make yourself at home. I'll be back very shortly. say now you are in for a treat so I'm just going to turn the volume down a little bit on these spaceships, spacecraft, and flying around in space, 
then this game is gonna tick all of those boxes for you. So this is one of those games which lets you literally do whatever you want in space, fly around and go in between things and what have you. There's a lot of freedom when you're flying around, which of course is really good. And you join a band of freedom fighters and you go on amazing adventures together. This has the ability to play with a friend as well, which is one of the things which I love in this, so you can take on the mantle of iconic Star Wars ships, all new ones, and you can battle it out against another player on split screen, for example, and see who lasts out in last longest in outer space. But as you notice, this is a real classic game, one of the best on PlayStation 2, and you'd get a lot of enjoyment out of this. open it up we've got classic memory card holder for your playstation 2 so you can store it in there always handy if you just designate a card to a specific game the disc in here is immaculate and superb and has all the appropriate artwork on there okay and then you get a booklet here as well. So every copy that I've bring up, by the way, these are my copies and we've got brand new versions of all of these. So everything's immaculate, but it's been exceptionally well loved and used. So here's the booklet. And this just harkens back to a bygone era of Star Wars and LucasArts and gaming. And this is when there was a lot of imagination and you felt like you were part of the movies. One of the amazing things with Jedi Starfighter is that all the cutscenes are so world immersive and makes it feel like you're in one of the prequel movies, which is really good. And it brings together all the love things from the prequel movies, which I think you'd really love as well. But these are almost sort of precious keepsakes, as it were, as games like these are literally from a bygone era of Star Wars. So if you're looking for an amazing game, fun, and you enjoy flying and all those sorts of games on PlayStation 2, this is a game which I think that you might be in. Okay, but it sounds like you're interested in it, so I will place it here for you. Well, that was all nice and quick there. Sorry, all those Farquhar chats are going crazy right now. So, following up from that, which was more episode two, episode three, Revenge of the Sith on PlayStation 2. This is one on two players, and this game is, what can I say? This is probably one of the best Star Wars games ever created. The freedom that you get through playing the characters in there, and the upgrades that you can give them, the satisfaction you get in all of the fights and duels and going through the whole movie, you'll get a different experience, an expanded experience with all of that as you play this game. So if this is something that you think you might love, Jedi, Sith, the tragedy of Darth Plagueis, the wise, then this game will certainly be up your street. Even the artwork on the back, it contains just iconic imagery and just is a constant reminder of these amazing games which was churned out by LucasArts during that time. Inside we have the perfect disc in there. You get your memory card slot up there as well. And also your Revenge of the Sith booklet, which always includes artwork there. One of the things which was a key selling factor for me when I first bought this game was it included loads of cutscenes from the movie, so you're able to spoil pretty much the whole movie for yourself if you're an insane ultra fan. 
and this game certainly didn't fail to disappoint. So this, if you enjoy battling it out against Sith, against droids, against your best friend, then this game includes all those things. It has extra options on there and pulls in characters from the original tr trilogy so you can duel one another as well. So if that's something you'd like, I can add of feeling that you might be interested in that one. <laughs> That's so great to see that you really wanted that. Okay, so our last PlayStation 2 game and I think Bounty Hunter So Django Fett game that we have around it's not in stock at the moment, but the Racer Revenge, so this is a very special game. Racer Revenge is a classic Star Wars game. So if you love racing and racing games and you love Star Wars, it's the perfect combination. If pod racing is your jam, like it certainly is mine, and I love it so much, and you wish there was a modern day version of this game, and you'd probably pay whatever money to get your hands in it, then this PlayStation 2 version, the sequel to the original Pod Racer game on the PlayStation, this is an amazing game. If you'd like racing around, of course, on the Boonta Eve track, you build your way up to that, but you go through different worlds and planets and race against all your favorite pod racers and new ones as well until you leveled up and you're ready to take on all of the pod racers at Boon to Eve. It is quite difficult in places but it's thoroughly challenging and enjoyable. So let's open that up. So we have the fantastic artwork there. And then we have the extras on here as well. So even this pristine condition you get it and it will basically be act as a keepsake if you love collecting Star Wars things as I do then this short to be an amazing item for your collection you didn't even let me ask if you wanted it yet okay we move on to the PC games very shortly games, anything strategic, say Age of Empires, if you played anything like that when you were younger or still play it like I do, then this is the Star Wars version of it. And I'd love to get an upgraded version of this as well. You can literally pick any Star Wars faction that you like from back in, I think this came out during the Attack of the Clones era, 
then you can battle it out against Empire, Rebels, Droids, Jedi, Clones, it goes on. And you can have amazing recreations of certain battles, but also make your own skirmishes and things like that, and just have a tremendous amount of fun being in command of all your troops and just absolutely killing it on the battlefield. Something very satisfying about this, the integration of iconic Star Wars ships, vehicles, and then new ones that you haven't seen before as well, which just fit perfectly in there. Makes for a great game. There's a brilliant campaign on this as well. It can be challenging, however challenging you want it to be, but you can do amazing work on the skirmishes and custom maps and you'll have a lot of fun recreating epic battles so if you really want to just completely zone out and go in control be in command of your armies and, and these battles and and make epic scenes then this will bring you a lot of enjoyment so if you like this game i will place it down for you right now a great choice that I thought I saw your eyes light up just a little bit. I don't know if you're familiar with this game, but this came out during the Phantom Menace era, and it's basically childhood. This game literally is one of the best and earliest Star Wars games which landed on PC and takes you straight to the action of everything which happened on the boo in the Phantom Venice. So basically, you're part of the Freedom Fighters and you've got to rally other fighters with you to your cause as well. And then you've got to build up to the final battle on the boo and lead and everything. But as you go on your journey, you don't go straight away. In the N1 Starfighter, you go across speeders, stabs, all sorts of ships and everything which might intrigue you. One of the things which I loved about this is that it was one of the first things which sort of allowed you to be in and a part of the movies. So the obsession with this game was strong and you'd get tons of enjoyment out of it just going around and shooting down droids and droid cars and MMTs and, and also AATs. You just have a great time with this game. You can play in space, you're up in the sky, you're on the ground, you're in the jungle. Well, let me just open that up. Well, okay, here's the booklet, and it's in also being pristine condition, just like this one as well. But it has all the great artwork, all the ships and classes, and everything that you need to enjoy this game. So, if this is something you keep beating me to it, I'll add it. I must say, your collection of games that are tallying up at the moment are amazing. Uh, so great to see such an avid gamer who has a great interest in these games. It's very impressive, you know. <laughs> okay. So, probably the most enjoyable game, Star Wars game, the one that opens you up to being a Jedi Knight, the one that makes you actually feel like a Jedi Knight. In my opinion, no other game has come close to that. Jedi Knight, Jedi Outcast, following Karl Katarn, gives you an opportunity to basically become a Jedi Knight. And even though it was challenging and hard, and sometimes you'd need a big booklet to follow just to help guide you on the way, this game offers you a Star Wars experience like no other and the free freedom you get being able to fight swing lightsabers wherever you want and just have ultimate control with a very user-friendly system is just being unmatched in my opinion and something which I'd love to see an updated version on even though you've got Jedi Knight Jedi Academy you can go beyond that and relive and remake this series and I'm sure it would be epic 
but if you love clashing of lightsabers, shooting stormtroopers, sneaking around and, and being basically everything that's great about Star Wars, it's in this game. And you'll go on a mission and you will see iconic characters go to iconic places and have all these amazing interactions. To me, this was always the sequel to Return of the Jedi and what happens afterwards. So if you like that sort of thing, if you want that freedom, then you're gonna love this game. So as you could tell, this has been well loved. The disc in superb condition there, and also the book here has all the things you need to know in this game and installation guides and everything like that. But even just the imagery of the game itself, it's just it's time in Star Wars LucasArts where it was just amazing. These are the types of things that probably should be framed. <laughs> Okay, and in your one you would include a fold-up poster, I think, there as well. So, if a Jedi Knight is what you fat, I'll place it down there for you. And may I say, what a great decision you have made there, too. Okay. And finally, if action is what you crave, and basically the beginning of the amazing battlefront, series franchise then this is the game which introduces you to all of that perfect goodness this star wars game this is like no other battlefront apart from battlefront 2 <laughs> but the freedom you get you can fly ships land ships wherever you want do whatever you want it felt like you were in control and the game wasn't controlling you unlike modern day battle front games but this the story the battles just everything about this game is pure perfection if you want fast intensity this game's got it if you want something a little bit slow paced but still battle this game's got it if you want to go across any faction this game's got it if you want to fly it this game's got it you can also be heroes as well that's from the movies this game has literally got everything inside a lot of my childhood was invested in this particular game or teenage years shall we say and the booklet of course pristine as well which you will get a brand new version gives you all the information you need to and one of the, the pros with this battlefront is that you can select which map you want to battle on as opposed to having randomly selected for you like the modern day games so it's quite a larger game so you have three discs to install okay disc three and then you have disc two and then disc one and all of the discs have iconic star wars imagery on them they look amazing and this is literally the epitome of an amazing probably one of the best star wars games ever so if you want literally everything in a, in a Star Wars game, I'm going to place it on there and assume that is the right decision for you. Perfect. I thought it would be. Well, okay, this server, it's still going strong. Okay, so there's a selection of us around here as well. We're sort of a bit more chill than everybody else in this area but we all do get together and we do play games together we literally close down and we just let everyone in who's interested and, and we make a bit of an event out of things we, we fire up the pcs the consoles and we really just have an amazing night you seem like you're one of us you love games you're clearly into it, you've clearly got amazing taste, and you, well, what I can assume, are somewhat relaxed after this experience, which is exactly what we try to create here, those sorts of vibes, because sometimes it's just good to go somewhere, and you just need to feel like you can just have fun, enjoy yourself, and sometimes 
a lot of the places around here and it can be a little bit intimidating especially with the presence of let's say Lord Farquhar and uh, all that he offers this area but also all of the shall we say let's say important people that uh, live around here they all get caught up and you know what it's like around here but we'd like to make sure that in between all that there's the complete opposite and I'd like to think that you feel welcome and like you could join in with us anytime you want you're always welcome so if you would like to come to one of those game nights this is the computer here that I'm on the server with everyone so I don't know if you've been to the it's like a very friendly barber is on here okay suit suit store it might surprise you if you've been to the doctors as well around it yep he's on this server as well so if you would like it just so happens that tonight we're holding one of those events there's no rush at all for this evening they will just turn up when they want but we're pretty much doing an all-nighter we're gonna call in some some takeaways pizzas chickens fried chicken and just make a night of gaming stick on the headphones and have an amazing time you're very welcome to join us if you'd like which just so happens that the microphone has been on just a little bit and everyone here is saying what amazing taste you have get them to join in and love to see you and we need another member to join us so if that's something that you like i can get all those games uh, i can get them all packed up for you you can take them whenever you want but we will set aside the customer and the game store owner okay relationship and so we will ignite the friendship flame and you will be one of us and we can have a great night together gaming if that's something that you keep answering it all for me that's amazing that's so cool and we're gonna love having you here with us as well so you're gonna have literally months worth of enjoyment of all of these Star Wars games so I'll get these I can get them delivered to you if you want or I can bag them all up you'll have all your Star Wars games there ready perfect okay so I'm just gonna sign out all these forums let them know you're coming and we'll go and start gaming sounds like the perfect night to me all right then so thanks for coming see you in a bit take care cheerio